support. One of the things that we are very well known for and we have tried to grow is our, our trauma treatment. Um, all of our staff are trained in evidence-based trauma treatment and grief support. And it's one of those things that we're known for all around the county and people come to us just for that. Um, we have two very specific grief support groups that are very different than anything anybody else does in the, in the county. One is at a loss, which is a support group for parents who have lost um, children. Um, that, has, uh, that was started by Joanne Holdreth, um, who many of you know. She lo they lost their son, their 17-year-old son, I think it's been eight years ago. Um, and um, she started that, and it's amazing how many people are, have been involved in that group. Um, I was told that last week there were 15 new families that came to the group. So there's a lot of need in this community and beyond for this kind of support. Um, we also started a group last year called Weathering the Storm, and we worked with the Franklin County Coroner, the Union County Coroner, and the Delaware County Coroner um, to create this group for people who had lost loved ones to violence. And um, that, again, you would not believe the stories of the people that are coming to that group. It's all the kinds of things that you read about in the paper. It's people you've read about in the paper who have, who have lost um, loved ones to violence. And again, the focus is very different um, than the one up above. But these are things that are happening in Dublin that you may that you may not have not have been aware of. Um, we have tons of partnerships with other organizations, which I will not go through. One of the things that we try to do is we get we try to get out there and work with as many people as we can. We do a lot of work with foster families and biological parents of foster children. We do a lot of work targeting and working with other organizations. So not only do we have an amazing relationship with Dublin and Washington Township, but we work with folks from all over the county. And it's my pleasure to do that. I've been um, able to do this for three years, and um, I have the best job in the land. Um, one of the big things that's hitting us right now and hitting everybody in healthcare is healthcare reform. It's good. Um, for us, in terms of that behavioral health care, is supposed to be um, integrated with primary health care. We're doing a lot of work on that. We're no different than anybody else in the health care field. We're all, it's all in, man. We're, um, we're working on that and making sure we're positioning ourselves to be um, able to play in that market. So um, I'm getting some knowing smiles or uh, head shaking with that one. All of this, and we have to keep looking at what our community needs are, what our clients' needs are, and then operating our agency, because we want to be here for another 34 years. I won't be up here talking about it, but somebody will, I hope. So thank you all for everything that you do to support us, and if you have any questions, I'd be happy to answer them.